the ref. Hey there, YouTube. Team Social Link here. Um, I'm giving you a deck profile of the deck that I took to uh, um qualifiers in Chicago. Um, I did come in, um, I don't know what place I came in, but I did make it to the fourth round. Um, I did lose to a Link Joker player. Um, it was a fun game, but I kind of misplayed so badly because when I was counting the triggers and all that, I thought she wasn't going to get a double crit on me, and she actually did. What Link Joker deck with it? Uh, Cast Breaker. But anyhow, I was playing uh, Liberators, um, the Monarch Raffer build. Uh, I use Liberator, Cheer Up Trumpeter. People were saying for me to use um, the one that you put the Blaster Blade from the deck on top of the deck when all that by putting them in the soul. I don't really like that. I like Trump Trumpeteer. And besides, my deck name in, um, in Chicago was called My Angels of Hope anyway, so I'd rather keep it with My Angels. <laughs> Chaos Breaker, Desi. Um, so yeah. Trumpeteer put in a soul, your vanguard gets get plus 3,000 power for each unit superior call from the deck. And I played four heals, uh, Napal, um, Liberator, I like that heal trigger, it's so adorable. Uh, four draws, I'm going to be changing this up soon once the new trial comes out. So currently at the moment I am playing eight crits. Wait, you're gonna switch? Are you gonna switch something to crits? I'm gonna, gonna be go crits? I'm gonna be doing um no, I'm gonna be doing six, six draws. Six oh, six they crits. don't have enough straws yet. Right. We normally okay. run six six and paladin. Okay. Not really. Oh, that's what. No. I like six six because I'm used to it. I think I'm gonna put four draw back in my chaos breaker. For the grade ones, I am playing two um, physical force, liberator Zoan. Uh, pretty much when you spear call him from the top of the deck, put him. I don't know what it is. I think it's Zoan or Zoan. Uh, but either way, um, soul charge him into the soul. Look at the top three cards. Uh, let's see here, call that uh, liberator onto the field. I use only two of him for more soul charge for Alfred. And also, if I call him, and I could just call something behind him, something and all. So it's kind something, of it's decent. Something. Then for um, May Rain, May Rain, Bruno. For each card superior called one of those cards on the field, uh, it gets plus 3,000 with Monarch's ability now, because I guess there's a ruling on it now. When you superior call him and everything else, um, he is automatically a 90k booster, which I love the most. And then White Rainbow Liberator, uh, Balin, he's, um, he's like... Uh, what's his name from Shadow Paladins? Okay, he does have rainbow in his name. Um, I can't remember his name, but it's Claudus. one of Blessed Dark Calls from... Claudus. Claudus? I think. Yeah. Yeah, Claudus. Claudus. This is the Gold Paladin version of Claudus. Pretty much one but of... But even better. Yes, even better, because I, I get... Your name, the team sucks at name. Pretty much, um, when a Blessed Blade's called, I own Flip a Damage. Blessed Blade Liberator, I, I own Flip a Damage. Boy. But Sometimes. it does not have to be in front of this unit. I could have three of them on the field call one Blaster Blade. I get to unflip three damage. I like having two of them because it's a free counter blast, uncounter blasting for blaster blade. So it's I love, it. I like it at the moment. He also has rainbow in his name. I play four Halo Liberator Marks. I was playing two Halos, two Quintets. Then I changed it up to one Quint, um, one, and now I'm playing four Perfect Guards because this deck is a counter blast heavy deck and. I will be changing, I'm taking in one quick dip ball once the Legion comes out. So currently at the moment, this is what I'm playing as. For the grade twos, two Liberator of Royalty, Phelan, Toki, oh yeah, three, thank you. Uh, three Phelan, um, pretty much when I have a Liberator uh, Vanguard, this unit gets plus 3,000, so it becomes a Toki attacker. Then four Blaster Blade Liberators, you need to run four in this deck because of uh, Monarch's ability. Pretty much when you call this, when you ride this or call this counter blast to retire unit in the front row then four of one of my other angels um liberator star rain trumpeteer um pretty much uh when she's called to the rear guard or uh, yeah rear guard you can take a blaster blessed way liberator from the drop zone or from your soul put it on top of your deck shuffle your deck and superior call the top card of your deck i like her at four and she's decent um, I was actually happy I was actually able to get an SP off of my one friend because I could not see what its flavor text was on the wiki. <laughs> and now I'm happy. And then onto the boss. I play four monarchs for the grade threes. The literal boss. He is actually 
what really won me my games at the regionals. Yeah, he's the um, best. because I didn't use his ultimate break at all. I did against the Link, Link Joker player, but you have to be careful. It was really complicated. Um, but pretty much ultimate break is when you spear call a blaster blade from the top of your deck. This unit gets plus ten thousand power and a crit. Its limit break is counter blast two, counter blast three, soul blast three. Unlock, take all your unlock cards, put it on top of your deck, or all your rear guards and put them on the top of the deck even if they're locked. Superior call top five cards from the top of your deck in any order. And yeah. So it's pretty good against Link Jokers. I lose against Link Jokers a lot. I suck with it. But and then his other ability um, is whenever this unit attacks, it gets plus a thousand for each uh, 10,000. 1,000. I forgot who the Link Joker player was. He gets 1,000 from... Um, <laughs> he loses his Um, He gets 1,000 for each rear guard with Gold Paladin. Just like, who does so does his list? ultimate break stack? Yes. It's like, oh, I actually like that because it does like... stack. I really do. I wish I was able to use his um, limit break multiple times, but it turns out I'm not I wonder how too. big the next alpha but and shoulder pads are going to be. We already know. Really? Seekers. Are they, like, huge? Yes. <laughs> they actually are. It's a sad thing. <laughs> and then, all he's going to be is shoulder pads. It seems like it. And then for the backup Vanguard, I play for Zenith. I like Zenith. He is good because after you counter blast with a, um, Alfred, you're done. You have to ride into something else. So I ride into Zenith, and I'm able to use the two extra counter blasts to use his ability to get four attacks off. Um, because it's this guy's ability is counter blast one. When this unit attacks, take a grade two or lower rear guard, go paladin liberator, put it on the bottom of your deck, superior called the top card. And it is a cross ride. If there's a Gansalad in the soul, um solitary liberator, Gansalad's in the soul, this unit gets plus two thousand, but I don't run him at all. But yeah, this is the deck um that I was using at regionals in Chicago. Like I said, I was doing good. Like, I was undefeated up to round three. I was not misplaying or anything like that. And then all of a sudden, I went up against a Link Joker player. <laughs> she was doing good. I had plenty of guards. I did not um, miss guards or anything like that. It wasn't guards or anything like that. It was um, more like... I didn't think she was going to count because when I counted um, her triggers, there was 11. So I didn't think she was going to get two, and her deck was still big because she wasn't able to use um, Chaos Breaker's effect because of Alfred. And um, I only dropped a 10 shield for two to pass because she was only at 11. She had no units on the field. And yeah, she got two triggers on me. And Shout I was out like, to my invader brother out there. I want to be your brother, be your sister. Brethren. Brethren. Sith wouldn't be Sith. So never mind. Brethren just means. Yeah, I know. Um, <laughs> but yeah, so I lost to that, and then fourth round was a uh, Shadow yeah, Paladins, and first. due to that, Six times. I was pretty much down. Like because I've been depressed a lot, but I was pretty much down, and I lost in the fourth round to a uh, Shadow Paladins. I would have been okay. I would have been Shadow able to make it one more round. But he did get a crit with uh, Raging from standing up a second time and gave it to his rear guard, and I didn't ha not have enough guard for that, so I lost to that. But yeah, well, I hope you liked the uh, deck profile. Um, please like, comment, subscribe, and um, next video will probably be our freaking.